Kevin focuses in on his mission. He's set his sights on the Groove, an unrepeated route originally rated E11, the highest grade in England's peculiar rating system. The E grade is supposed to incorporate the entire experience. You know, it's, yeah. it's how bad the gear is, how hard the gear is to place, how just how weird the route is. E is for extreme. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, E is for extreme. If I fall, I'll probably land right close to the ground. So we're gonna have George uh, put his cleats on and run. I don't really know um, what B lane's like in the States and how different it is, but a lot of the times, I think uh, in the grit routes, because it's so short, you end up having to take in slack to stop your climber hitting the floor. So there's always that little bit of extra pressure in that if you don't do your job properly, uh, you know, you're probably gonna have a climber with broken legs or something, so it's just like, uh, <laughs> gotta make sure I do it right. I have faith. George is gonna stick it if I don't. <laughs> Wait, is it set up? Is it set up right? Pull on my end. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> When these three guys came across, I think it's been the most impressive tick list ever assembled on Gritstone, which really shook up the scene. They really had an effect here. So on behalf of England, Team America, we salute you. After six weeks of jittery nerves, ground falls, and miserable British weather, Kevin and the crew are starting to get worn down. The grit takes its toll eventually. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, it's really cold. I think I'm gonna try to climb. I'm not sure how. <laughs> oh, you're, you're on the ground there. <laughs> you're gonna wanna see this. I just ripped my finger off. No, dude, no. Oh, I, I, I basically just circumcised my finger. <laughs> Why did I grab that pebble? Oh, the good stone bites back today, eh? <laughs> Fucking back <bites. laughs> The original concept for coming to England was to treat it like a mental training in a way. Climbing here, you know, scaring myself silly for seven weeks definitely helps me go back with a re uh, like a renewed focus for what I want to do in Bishop. I can't wait for that to heal. Yeah.